We arrive in Grand Prairie near the Winter Valley Regional Railway's maintenance facility, just as crew members are finishing filling out their track warrant. The train will be heading east, all the way to the end of the line at Fox Creek. Trackside model railroading, where the hobby comes to life. The manifest rounds the curve past the shops and starts its journey. Further east in Pearson, we see that there's a get-together at the mobile home across the tracks. We watch the train come through Pearson, where it blows its horn at the crossing. At the main drag in Pearson, we catch the train again as it passes a crew working on something next to the tracks. We get a close-up from a low angle as the train rolls past the Pearson Hotel at the edge of town. We see people down at the pond as the train enters the outskirts of Pearson's sister city, Hudson. Hudson is a farming community. Those impressive silos are part of the Pearson wheat pool and store grain for farmers from miles around. Notice Dave's clever use of carpet as a wheat field in the foreground. Near the Smoky River, we watch the SD-40-2 lead the manifest as it travels up the grade toward the mining complex. The crew rolls past a worker up at Colder. The two SW-1200 switchers have been working the mine. The crew continues east, moving upgrade toward the summit, and past a lease Canadian National GP38-2W. The Winter Valley leases CN Motive Power and has purchased all of its own power from the CN. The 
manifest has arrived in Winter Valley, and traffic waits for it at Main Street by the cycle shop. From a different angle, we catch the rest of the train as it crosses Main. This area is restricted to yard limit speeds. The train has reached the edge of Winter Valley and the local green co-op. The co-op is in the midst of its busy season, with farmers trucking in the harvest and the railroad hauling it out to interchange with the CN and BC rail. It looks like a motorist here is in need of a tow. Fortunately, the car did not stall out on the tracks. The train has finally reached Fox Creek, the end of the line for the little short line. Off to the right, you can make out part of the lighthouse bar and grill. We've heard the food is good, and we might head over there for a meal. Thanks for taking along with us to check out the WVRR. In the full movie, we'll also chase some CN motive power as it leads trains on the Winter Valley Regional Railway.